Please make a U-turn where safe. In 50 yards, turn left. Shoot on. Turn right. What's wrong with you? Fuck me? <laughs> fuck me? You can't fuck me, baby B. Name one thing you have ever been able to fuck me at. One thing! Huh? I lift more weights, I fly better choppers, I have better cars, I screw better women. Hell, I screw women. My bling ain't CZ, and my paper ain't a photocopy. What's up, Lou? So again, one! Ah. Hey, Maury, I got a side with your brother on this one, man. I mean, you're fucking annoying. I mean, I work in nightclubs. <laughs> I hang out with gangsters. I meet assholes 24 hours a day. But you, you take the cake, man. Oh, oh geez, I'm sorry. Sorry that I'm trying to toughen up my little bro here. My little bro who I love more than life itself. And you think that you can interfere with that? Yeah, I think maybe you're taking the tough love thing a little too far, man. I mean, I got sent to juvie when I was 17 years old for shooting a teacher who felt up my sister. They tried the tough love thing with me. It didn't fucking work too well. So maybe try a different fucking approach. You know what? I think you might be right. Come on, baby B. Let's hug it out. Yeah? Let's hug it out. Okay! Oh, I love you. <laughs> I love you, I do. I love you. It's just, the truth is I'm, I'm jealous. I am, I'm jealous. I'm jealous that, that you are dating such a wonderful guy as Lou here. It's Luis. Whatever. I'm only kidding. Come on. J Jesus, you guys are a couple of pent-up queens, I swear. Come on, let's go have some fun, huh? You too, B. Come on, stop sulking. Jesus, you're pathetic. <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> I love you, but you are such a pussy. Come on! Yeah, we got some cars waiting at the top of Middle Park, bro. Here, take these headsets. Excuse me if I don't trust the pair of to think for yourselves. Hey, Brucey, bro, it's good to hang with you. I'm really happy you're along on this ride. Maury, bro, are you fucking with me? Come on, little B. And hey, what do you take me for? It's good to have Lopez along, too, right? Hey, the three amigos. <laughs> Yo, two men and a little cunt. Ah, <laughs> yeah, you hear that, Brucey? He called you a little cunt. Yeah, I wasn't talking about him, bro. Don't bring down the positive energy, Lopez. Me and my brother are having fun today. Yeah, man, we are. We should do this more often, bro. Oh, B, shit. Before I forget, there's this email that I got that I thought you'd be interested in. Oh, yeah? What's that? Oh, you see? It's this doctor. He's a fucking genius. Yeah, he says he's made this bill that is gonna sort out that penis problem you got. Nah. Fuck off, boy. I thought you were being cool, bro. No, no, I am, bro. I swear it. No, this guy can extend your hose by at least two to three inches. Hey, call me an asshole, but I'd be really psyched if my bro was back in a four-inch punch. How's that for cool? Shut up, Maury. The one thing you do got going for you is those roid ravaged beans in your sack. <laughs> Anything would look big hanging next to those peanuts, right? Huh? Am I right? Shut the fuck up, Maury! <laughs> ah, pathetic! You see this guy, Lopez? What did I tell you? I don't know, bro. I tend to stop listening when you open your mouth. Remind me again what you paid for that place in Broker, Brucey. Huh? Oh, and a garage, too. How much did you pay? I don't want to talk about this. And, uh, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. What are those properties worth now? Ha, <laughs> ha, ha. said I don't want to talk about it, okay? Shit. You see, what did I tell you, Lopez? Overexposed like a stripper in Fleet Week. Only thing more useless than that little pecker of his is his portfolio. Ain't that right, Brucey? Hey, leave him alone, Maury. You're even more annoying than usual. He's a bit like you and Big Tone, actually. Hey, you guys should start a Debtors Anonymous circle jerk together. <laughs> There's my boy, the loser. If he tells me to smoke outside again one more time. Hey, buddy, thanks for the tip off. Here you go. Huh? Oh, thanks, bro. Hey, don't go spend that all in one place, chump. All right, people. Money talks. An idiot's walk. Bud, bring down my car, man. Here, have fun. Okay, moving out, ladies. Follow me. Shit, bro! Why are the cops all over us? Yeah, man. How they know what's up? Wake up, pansies. I called them. Shit just got intense, huh? Are you Alpha or Omega? You think you can handle it? I fucking hate you, bro. Tiny orange turd. Myself. Thank you. They're coming down heavy, bro.
what you bitches can do on a street. Shut up and drive, bro. Ah, hey, anyone for a beef drink? <laughs> At a good angle, don't fuck it up. It's your car, bro. If you want to try it. Now go easy on this one. You don't want to overshoot the third. Bring her home, bitches. Intense! Yeah. <laughs> oh, did you see little Lou here though? He started shitting his panties when the cop showed up. <laughs> hey, check it out, Brucey. You know, I think Lou here might be even slightly bigger pussy than you. <laughs> we're done, right? I mean, we're squared. You got your cars now, so now I don't have to sit here and listen to your tiny man bullshit. <laughs> sure, sure, Lou. Sure, sure, sure. You could go if you're as dumb as you look. Ooh. Excuse me. You got an opportunity here. Look at me, look at me. Watch my lips move. I can teach you things. <laughs> Come on, think apprentice. Think uh, intern, minion, yeah. Think uh, squire boy. You, following me all around, learning to become a business mastermind. No more clubs, no more Tony Queen. You, my friend, could be free. <laughs> Maury, is this a joke, man? I mean, you're the guy that needs to learn something. Oh. Shit, you're awful, bro. I mean, maybe someone can teach you the most basic human behavior. Brucey, please, do this guy a favor. Brucey? Me? Yeah, you're the guy in the family with some manners. Whoa. You think that I could learn something from little B here? The marshmallow man. More. This pale piece of turd. All right, cut yeah. it out, M. The man is nothing but beyond right. pathetic. That's it, boy! Cut it out! Yeah! Yeah! Are yeah. you kidding? Yeah! <laughs> Oh, 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 God, oh, God, what the fuck, man? What the fuck are you doing? Oh, God, you know the rule. I'm, I'm sorry, Maury, I forgot, man. Never, never in the face. Oh, come on. This is, this is top work up here. You know that I got a week in Zepta. Okay, oh, just, just, just don't tell Mom, okay? Okay? <laughs> okay, 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 just, you gotta take me home. Yeah, shit, okay, yeah, shit, come on, let's go, okay, okay, come on, yeah, 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 okay. Hey, I'll see you ladies later, okay? Yeah, uh, uh I'll see you at the club or something, okay? Yeah, I heard something. Asshole. You fucking cop!
Yo, Mr. Bulgarin here? I don't care hey. if he doesn't want to sell. I want to buy. How much oh. did you offer the last time? Double it. Offer 20 million, and then we see if it is not for sale. If this Banking is not hanging on my wall. Your hat will be. Okay? Think about that. You want I should pay visit to his children at their school? Not yet. I think there's always a price in this city. Oh, Louis, excuse us. We have been rude. Don't worry about it, man. I like the setup here. These guitars are all collector's items. Celebrity rock memorabilia. Okay, man, good for you. Got a nice place here, Mr. B. That is piece of shit. I bought it for my sister. Hey, you bring me to this fucking country, and you keep me in an ugly cage. No one on TV lives in fucking Duke. Then you come and move all my stuff into hallway after playing with fucking guitars. Shut up, bitch. Take your pills. A friend of mine is here. Ha! You don't have any friends. You don't even have a business here. You are nothing in this My country. sister. She's still getting adjusted. We all are. So how can I help you? Fuck you, Ray. You have ruined my life. Yes! Yes! <sighs> a difficult situation. It seems I'm being investigated by the National Office of Security Enforcement. There is a particular unit that has a hard on for me. And why? Because Mark Yashwili won't sell me the rampage. You'll get rid of them. I will own this fucking team. Hey, the problem ain't just gonna disappear over here if we kill some crooked cops. Leave the strategizing to me. If the money tells you to cut your fucking legs off, you'll do it. Because the money is better than a fucking leg. The money is making the plans. That's the American way. All right, man. Thank you. I like you. I make you rich. I make you man. Maybe I'll make you a man with one leg, but <laughs> I'll make you a rich man with one leg. There is this team tracing a cow mine. They count the whole team, no exceptions. Okay, man, if that's what the money wants. You're a bright guy, Luis. I still like you. You made a good choice coming here. Fag man, no good. Go. Roll the bitch. Ten, 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 ten. Go to the garage of Torpa Street. Calculating route. In 100 yards. Turn right. Here's a makeshift bar. What the fuck? It will be useful. That advanced MG you got there as well. I ain't taking no chances with the noose. It's good to have you with us, Louis. Yeah? Yes. It must be nice for you to get out from the under big Tony. I don't know what you're implying, bro. Tony and me are partners. I got a stake in the enterprise. <laughs> a stake, sure. You still take orders from him, don't you? You can up your shit. Right. It could be much more than that. Unless you enjoy working for such a man, partner or whatever you call it. Really, bro? I don't know. When I was left to my own devices, I got locked up. At least with Tony's guidance, I ain't doing time. Perhaps. For now, perhaps. But do you think you're achieving everything you could? A man with your talents, in your condition, you could have anything you want. I didn't get to where I am without being able to see the world. You want me of fucking man. hit you? That's real flattering, Mr. Bulgari. But whatever it is you're offering, I'm gonna have to decline. 
Me and Tony's is a business relationship. He gets his kicks elsewhere, but he's been a good boss to me and a good guy. Help me out. I'm not a fucking faggot! Whatever you say, bro. What are you talking about? I was saying that I may be interested in investing in your potential. I shoot this guy! Potential as what? As a businessman, I am looking for someone here in Liberty City with the correct relationship. I already got one employer. Like I said, he's been good to me. Of course, but what is he? He is a drug addict, a madman. You are useful to him, but you think that is all he wants from you. <laughs> when some new muscle-bound pretty boy comes along, he will forget about you and your precious stake in the Tony Prince Empire. Whatever, bro. Can we talk about something else? What am I doing here? You are helping me with my business. This don't seem like legitimate business to me, man. Nothing can be achieved here in Liberty City with actual pigs rooting through my affairs. For anything to happen, they must be eliminated. Okay, man. You really can't buy these people off? Sup? We need to go down into the lot. Park up this spot by the pillar. You have arrived. Place a bomb out of sight. We will hide here. They will still see that bomb! These guys are all crooked, huh? Marty has this in his pocket. This news team is in charge of half the drugs running in the city. Do not let your conscience worry you. Now, Louis, we see if you can handle this out. Don't worry about me. Shut up. On me! Stay vigilant! Stay in formation! The car's been rigged to blow!
Get back to my sister! I swear, they're putting my Excellent, back. excellent! Max Katsaka's born! I still have smell of meat in nose. Bro, it's true! You are one who blew them up! That you did, Louis! A serviceable job! Most competent! How'd I get myself into this shit, man? You didn't get yourself into this? I choose you! I pick you out because I see potential in you. You're lucky to be here. Yeah, great, thanks. But if you need more cops taken out, crooked or otherwise, you ain't choosing me. Look at this. The sensitive, modern American man. You need to go home and exfoliate your bolts. May as well cut them off. What the fuck is this? I don't like killing government agents, so I ain't got no balls? Give me a break. Okay, calm down. We got no more law enforcement to expand. For now. Those who are the only guys smack ahead of us. You think he will sell? There's no choice but to sell. We have taken away his protection. It's that simple, is it? It should be. Maki is a weakling. He lives here in exile, like all cowards. But he has been here for a long time, so he has more connections that others of us have not been able to acquire. This little creep should have severed the good deals of those connections and will give others involved a pause before they continue their association. Okay. Perhaps I will buy clubs of you as well. You sell them to me? Them clubs is levers to the max already, man. I don't know if there's anything left to sell. I don't care about other investors. They will forget about debts if I'm involved. Some of these investors aren't the type to go away. They aren't the type to pay off either. Anyway, it's not my place to sell them. I have a stake, but Tony's got the controlling share. Ha! Ha! Of course! Tony pulls the stream, and the little puppet man dance for him. Let me know when Tony next has hand up your ass and run thriller quiz, Danny can talk. Fuck, man. What's wrong with you? Your stake is bullshit. You think you run the club, but you are still just security. You are Tony Skim, and you won't admit it. It's not like that. This what you want to do your whole life? No, but seriously, bro. I have opportunities for you. Think about that. Think about what I said to you. The offer will not be there forever. Okay, I will. Send my regards to Big Tony. Where can I take North you? Holland, yo. Good as good. This is it.